What's up guys? It's just another day at work. No one's here today, so I'm changing, I'm adding a, a monitor bracket right now. You can see it right over here. So it's a brand new monitor and I don't want to scratch it up. So like the easiest way for you to fix, fix that problem. So you don't scratch up your monitors. What I recommend doing is it comes with a cover already. So it has a cover on it. You get the cover, right? And you put it on top of the monitor like so, like this, right? So you see, now I could just unscrew everything because you have a brand new monitor, right? And you, you don't want to, you don't want to scratch it up. So I don't want to scratch up my monitor. So I, I do it that way, right? You can excuse the fire alarm or the, the ambulance, whatever. They're just passing by over here. So yeah, so basically you just put the cover on it. And then after that, you should be good, good after that. That's the easiest way to fix this. Um, there's no other way to do it because you don't want to scratch up the monitor. It's a brand new monitor, so it doesn't make any sense for you to scratch it up. Right? And these these uh, these same screws that I'm taking out, they're gonna go right over here on the on the arm. So what I do is. Right. Hopefully you could you could see it. You should be able to see it. Yeah. So what I'll do is, see I have these monitor arms. I have screws here separated already for it. So basically, you grab your monitor. See how it's not scratched up. It's brand new. And then basically, you put it in an angle. And then you grab your screwdriver right over here. And then you just mount it. Basically, you mount it. So you get the screw and you mount it. Some people will say, oh my God, there's so much work. Okay, why is it so complicated to do this? You know, it's not. This isn't rocket science. Anyone could do this. If I could do this, you could do this. So the easiest way to do it is just screwing one in. Once you got that first one in, you're you're pretty much you're pretty much set. You don't gotta worry about this. So I like to screw the the, the top one. Then after that I screw the bottom one. Cause once I got the once I got the top one and the bottom one, we're pretty much good after that. It's much easier to do after that. So once you got those two, you have to worry about it. It's easy. Now, now it's not gonna fall out because I have two screws on it, and then basically. You continue off with the other ones. Simple as that. See? So you don't just so you don't scratch up the monitor. You see how I just how I just put a piece of paper on it or I use the same cloth that it comes with? This is the same office that I changed. I added the phone, by the way, this morning. So I'm just showing you what I do on a day-to-day -day basis. Um, and that's it. So you gotta worry about. And then obviously you add the necessary cables here, which I'm gonna do right now. So I'm gonna add a power plug. I'm gonna add USB port. So this this what this USB port does is this enables the USBs for the side of this. So you see there's using USBs here. It actually enables it. Put that in there. And then you have your your display cable. It's a little tangled, but it should be fine. Let me plug that in. And that's it. That's all you gotta do. And then you just you just grab the cable. 
neatly pack it in there, you know, make it nice and neat. Same thing with the other ones. This one's gonna go on the table because I'm gonna put a laptop here. So you grab it, same thing, make it nice and neat. And then you have your USB that's gonna go on the table as well. So you're gonna unwrap this again. You have three cables in total that you're racking basically here. Make it nice and neat. You see it's like, comes out easily, which is fine. That's why you have these, that's why you have this for, for this one. So you wanna put it on this one first, before you put it on the other one. Let me grab this one as well. Once you got that, you're good. This has got to be neat because it's all about cable management. The new hire starts here next, not next week, in two weeks from now. And I don't want them, you know, I don't want to give them the wrong impression that they come here and they're like, damn, this, this is a, this is their IT guy? This is the IT guy? Like, the IT guy is kind of, kind of crappy. He's yeah, just like, he's not organized at all, so, you know. That's it. That's pretty much it. You see how I did that, right? So, look at it now. It's nice and neat. The cable is like sticking out. This cable is sticking out a little bit. You just, just push it in. Push the cable in and you're good. So, just showing you. Look at it. See, it's like this cable is sticking out a little bit Let me take it out for a second go all the way over here put it back in again it's this one I make this nice and neat, as neat as possible, because you know you want it to be looking like a shit show. You know, so the last thing you want is for it to look like a shit show. So grab all those cables again, including that one. Put it in there. Now it's. Now it's now it's the right way. Now it's actually in there. Same thing with this one. Just push those cables in there. Make sure you got all three in there. It's not. This isn't rocket science. You just you know set up the cables and that's it. Yeah, and that's it. See, it's still a little a little. A little bit there but it's not the end of the world it's supposed to look like this so then you just tuck it in in the back and that's it it's all about cable management all right guys you guys have a great friday take care bye